As soon as I turn off the camera, it like slams shut. You think there's somebody in there? Hey, these guys, these idiots are gonna walk down there. Oh my! Oh my god. What is in here? Oh! What's up guys, Sam and Colby. Today we are here back at the abandoned town. We are standing right in front of the door that was opening and closing right at the end of the video. We're sitting here trying to catch it again because it is not windy. There's a lock on that freaking door and it keeps opening. In a few minutes here, we're gonna be going inside there as well as the haunted school. Like we said in our last video, this is like a military town. It used to be called Fort Wingate, the town that now has moved literally just two miles that way with no explanation as to why this got as you saw last video, burnt down and then moved. We're trying to figure out why everyone just kind of got up and left. And like if there's some haunted weird shit like that happening in the back, I would understand why. Because this entire town, I forgot to mention, was built on top of a military graveyard. So most people believe it's to be haunted. Two seconds ago, that door opened out of nowhere. After 10 minutes of us just chilling here, I believe it's haunted And too. if you guys didn't see the first video, there were door slams in there. We heard a girl screaming. I don't know if we ever said that, but there was a girl screaming in the background. The freezer door shut in the background last time. We're about to go in the most haunted part. Yeah, this is definitely the scariest part. There's the elementary school. Baseball field, the stadium, there's the uh, basketball courts, there's the cafeteria, and then here's what we're exploring today. It's like definitely the creepiest and it's the most boarded off. This entire thing has barbed wire fence seven feet tall. All the windows are completely boarded. We're not the first people to go in, so easy little thing. Does that have any sign on it? Nope. What? This is old. You can just feel how old it is by walking on it. It's oh like, my oh, God. God. oh my God. That looks so creepy. Should we, just, should we just go for it? Oh, that sounded like a snake. Yeah, let's just, let's just do it. Alright, better than getting caught by the security that patrols around here. Why is it so much colder in here, bro? Dude, it's freezing. This looks so much like one of those horror films. Right on this other side, it's right where the door kept slamming at the end of the last video at the beginning of this. What? That graffiti says death and it's pointing to that door. A lot more eerie of a vibe than everything else we've explored so far in this town. Oh, who wants to go in there first? Oh my god. We gotta go down. It's just the Whoa! Oh, 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 holy s! Oh, I dropped it! Oh, God! Yo, 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 yo! Oh, my God! That scared oh, the living hell out of me. What was that? We were looking down the hole. I don't understand. That's a like, huge metal a door. Huge... We just saw the lock on it. Think about it like this, guys. There's metal doors that you can see in the background everywhere in this place, and all the doors would be slamming if there was wind. It's, it's only this one. one. And it slammed right. There's a noise. Dude, we gotta go. Not stay right here. Okay, okay. This is a bad place. Dude, I don't wanna like not look behind me. I wanna believe so hardcore that that was the wind, but like part of me, with all this like eerie vibe, it doesn't. I can see how like people might say some of the windows are open, so maybe there's like a tunnel of air that just travels through here. That wouldn't explain anything because as we showed like at the beginning, all the windows are boarded up. Maybe two that are open. You know yeah. what I mean? Like you said, there's more doors that could be opening and closing. Like that one right there is open. Why isn't that one opening and closing? We literally explored the entire town and everything was left completely like open. All the desks, all the books, the house still had furniture in it, but this is completely barren. Yeah. Why did in here. this one's out of everything got taken out? This is creepy. And it looks by far the most wrecked too. Everything's starting to fall apart. It's just loud every single step. It's bare. Everything. Everything's gone. What was that? I don't know. It sounded like footsteps, right? Yeah. Right around the same door. Right around the same door. Let's stay away from that staircase. Or can you hear those voices? Does that sound like children? It sounds like little kids. I swear I've been hearing that the whole time. 
comment down below any other weird noises you guys might be hearing because... Yeah, or if you see anything in the video, like tag us on Instagram or something. All the sinks right there, the urinals. Just in there in town. Oh, see, now you can hear the wind. Wow. Oh my god, there is a ton of crap back here. Here's some showers. Crap in there too. Don't try to soak it. <laughs> Very end, it's broken. Bro. It's going down. Oh my gosh, okay, I'm going, I'm going, I'm going. Here's the outside balcony. They've locked off the stairs. <laughs> Creepiest door of all time. What's in here? Never mind. These are the creepiest doors of all time. Another bathroom or something? I don't know. Yeah, we gotta be careful in here. Look, the floor is caving in again. What is this? Why does this room have like stone walls and stuff and everything else does it? <laughs> Alright guys, so we basically explored everything around here. Everything's taken out of every single room. Everything's pretty boarded up. I don't know what's left besides like that creepy room. Door slammed right behind me or Oh the yeah, roof. yeah, yeah. We gotta do that. Well, since we know how to get to the downstairs area, let's do that first. And then if there's nothing down there, we go to the roof. Sure. Even when the camera's off, I know we're jumping around a lot. We're still hearing like weird noises. Door slamming, children screams. Like this is the elementary school area. Like there's the playgrounds and that's exactly where we heard the screams. And we've checked multiple times. There's absolutely no one here. And the closest town, like we said, is two miles that way. I just have no idea. Yeah. Like unexplainable stuff is happening right here, but let's go down to that. And basement. again, if you guys hear anything that we don't hear, comment down below. Oh God. Level one, slam came from right there. Don't tell me it's open. No, it's still closed. Still closed? Whew. That thing slammed right in front of us. Twice. Three times. First video. Second video. Not here. God, I don't want to stand like that. I know, that's freaking me out, bro. Okay, um... Like, okay, so people on camera can see this and be like, you know what, I'm fine, I have popcorn in my hand, these guys, these idiots are gonna walk down there. Oh <laughs> my god! <laughs> Okay, Dude. maybe I shouldn't say, tell stories. Uh, but I'm just saying this is terrifying in real life. Okay, let's go. Just gotta step on the way corner like this. Okay. Like somebody, somebody please explain to me why we even do this stuff. Mexican ghost hunters. Shout out to you guys, what's up? Maybe this is a good spot to put our sticker at? Very basement of the scariest place in this ghost town. There we go. We are officially part of the Mexican ghost hunters. <laughs> Has to be like a hundred rats in here. Everywhere. Uh, Dude, my flashlight's going out. Oh, shoot, really? Yeah, look at that. Oh, my goodness. Don't you think that this place could just fall on us at any second? Can you see those freaking floors? We're about to cave in. I just hate crawl spaces in general. I feel like we're always in them. And, like, <laughs> especially because that stupid museum, it's like every serial killer. When was the last time we were in a crawl space? That Malibu Mansion thing, like a couple weeks ago. <gasps> oh, shit. Go, 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 go. Okay. It's closed. <sighs> Uh, here, camera, camera, camera! Oh my. Knock one out there, knock one out there. What is in here? Holy oh, shit. Get it, get it again, are you kidding me? Wait, look. It's closed. Again. When we went down, it opened. Let's get out of here. What are you doing? What are you doing? Got a hole in the fence, bro. Okay. Watch out for the security. Watch out for the security. Alright. There it is. We should be fine. Wait, yo, why are we running? I honestly just kind of want to get out of there. Oh, oh God. This is good. It's like. He's got like a Santa beard down to his stomach. Dude, this place just gets creepy and creepier. I don't like ghost towns. If any of you guys can explain why that happened, please comment down below. Yeah, maybe wind, but I feel like it was only in specific situations and only that one door that was closing when there was obviously so many doors and that were left noises. abandoned. And other noises and children's screams and everything. So just completely unexplained. All right guys, so that was pretty, pretty intense. The entire town was really creepy. We're back. At the car, we're going back to Albuquerque, New Mexico. Still, unexplained everything. Super 
creepy haunted area. We said in the beginning, it was built on a graveyard and it supposedly is haunted, so I don't know what we found there though. Like we said, if you heard anything in this video or in our part one video, which if you haven't seen, go check it out. Comment that below, tag us on Instagram, on Twitter, whatever you need to do, just let us know what you guys heard because we're still trying to figure out what all went on during these two videos. As always, get your XPLR merch, link in the description. And subscribe for more of these New Mexico videos. Got a lot more coming. But either way, we will see you guys next time, so.